Hey guys, this is Kimberly from Starfish Designs Embroidery. I just wanted to show you a quick tutorial here. Um, no sew, no embroidery, and it's a great way to use up the scraps that you have. You're going to need um, one lobster clasp of whatever size style you want, split ring, four inch by three quarters inch scrap of, this is actually leather I got some scraps of, or um, vinyl. It needs to have a little bit of body to it, so what I've done is this um, silver tool. It's kind of thin, so I am doubling it over, so that's four inches. The width would be whatever your opening is for your split ring, which mine is three quarters inch. You need a hole punch, and you need some rivets, and I got double cap rivets here. Hopefully you can see all that. And then you need a rivet press. I'm using the rivet dies in the new cam press that I have. So all we're going to do is we're going to insert our lobster clasp inside um, and insert the split ring on the other end. And then we're going to fold this over. And because I'm doing this fold over one, I'm going to make it so that the, the straight edge is folded inwards. And so that we have the pretty fold on the outside. Okay. And you're just going to fold it over so it overlaps by about a half an inch. Is okay. And then carefully, and I would actually, I forgot to bring some clips with me, but I would actually use some clips to hold this in place while you do the next step. Um, I should have done that because we don't want our hole to get out of line. So we're going to go ahead. I'm going to move my press out of the way here a minute. Make sure you can still see me. I'm going to go ahead and put my hole punch and center it. If you want to be really, really good, you can go ahead and get a, a ruler or something and measure. I'm just eyeballing it. Okay. Now don't let go, put your rivet in there, and it's going to be really thick, okay? Turn it over and put the cap, you might want to move out the excess material there, and the cap is going to snap, you can't, I don't think you could hear that, but it's going to snap into place, but that's not enough, you need to press it. So we're going to put this into our rivet press, and we're going to push down. And there you go. It's a cute little um, keychain. Use it up with your scraps. And you can hook this onto your main key. And then put your valet key on here. So if you need to give this to your service people. Um, you might want to center it a little bit better so it's in the center there. I didn't do a good job of that. I will on this one. Okay, so again. Now this is leather. So I'm going to center these in here. Oh, okay. Keep knocking this over. Okay, can you see that? I'm going to center this on here, and we're going to overlap it. So it's overlapped about a half. On the right, this one I'm going to center better. <laughs> it's kind of silly of me not to do a better job on that first one. Okay, so I'm going to try and center it right in the middle, make sure everything's together, punch the hole in it. We'll see if this works because um, this is actually pretty thick. So I don't know if these rivets are thick enough. You might need longer rivets, okay? These are actually the sample rivets that I got when I bought the die from Cam Snap. Push it all the way through, and then put the cap on, and you wanna make sure you hear that little click. You can hear it, you can't on the video, but I can. Now put it into your press, and press down. I'm putting a little pressure on this one because it's so thick. And there you go. How cute is that? A great way to use up some scraps of vinyl. Um, I bet you could probably get five bucks each for these at a craft fair. I did. I should have put uh, the rivet centered it down there. You'll do a better job than me. But um, it's a cute little thing um, that you could add on to your keychain. Um, if you wanted to, you could actually... Um, where did my lanyard go? I had some here. Here it is. 
I'm going to take and hook this onto your wristlet that you have all your keys on, like that. And then when you need to give a key to somebody for whatever reason, like maybe your son to run in the house, you can pull it off and you don't have to undo it and have to mess up your fingernail polish with the split ring. All right, I hope you guys like this little one. Thanks.